Patrick's Day may have officially passed, but the wear another green yeah. and so much more continues not only here but in New Dublin. Jordan is at Pops Irish Pub with a preview. Top of the morning to ya. Top of the morning to you guys. Yes, I actually met Pup. He's back behind the bar. It's awesome. He's a, he's a celebrity here. But every single restaurant and bar in New Dublin here is, you know, they're, they're all dressed up. They have everything here to celebrate uh, the Irish heritage that is that runs deep here. And we actually have the leprechauns here, too, who are talking to you. You may know these guys from hanging up the, the signs. Uh, there's about uh, six of these magical characters that go around. And do this, and we actually have four of them here that are going to be uh, willing to talk to us. Top you know, of the morning. Yeah, top of the morning. What's the, what's this tradition like for you guys? I mean, for anyone who doesn't know the New London tradition, what's it like? Oh, it's great for the families. Uh, leprechauns go around to the uh, hospitals and the old folks' homes, and the kids love us. Yeah. We hand out stickers, and we tell them to get ready for the the parade on Saturday. Exactly. Is it is it all leading up to the weekend? Is is the weekend the real party here? Oh, yeah, it's the whole week is uh, a <clears throat> good time. Uh, we change the signs, then we eat corned beef and cabbage, yeah. and uh, <laughs> entertainment last night was great. Yeah, and you, you can't forget the Guinness, right? I mean, the Guinness is part of this, right? Well, part of it. <laughs> <laughs> now, you, you actually have a, yes, a little yes. injury from this weekend, or actually uh, from earlier in the week when you we, hang we, up the signs. We so. didn't have any Guinness, otherwise, he, if he would have had a Guinness, he would have hit my fingers. So. <laughs> this is clearly a joke, so I hope it is, right? Well, yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yes, it is. All right. Now, we actually have uh, some of the newer uh, leprechauns here. This guy's been doing it for three years now. You know, what's this, what's this like for you to celebrate, uh, you know, St. Patrick's Day like this? Uh, it's, it's really cool starting with my dad um, being an original leprechaun and be, us being the first to second generation leprechauns. Yeah. It's really special and something yeah. fun to be a part of, I guess. And, you know, being, having a whole week-long celebration, is that kind of neat for you guys to, you know, be known kind of nationally for this, too? Yeah, I mean, it's it's nice to be, I guess, almost a celebrity for a week. Yeah, right? <laughs> it's, it's fun. Exactly. Um, it's, uh, it's super cool. Yeah, I think, I think so, too. Now we have uh, Jill over here who organizes the parade. Yes, Jill, we're coming over to talk Hi, to you, everybody. too. This is, yeah, my coffee. It's normal coffee, not Irish coffee today. Uh, but, Jill, you know, what's the parade like? This is kind of the, the, the final hurrah, I guess, at the end of the week. Right? It is. It's, uh, it's the finalization of a year's worth of a lot of hard work by a lot of good people. Yeah, and what can people expect if they show up to the parade? Well, we have um, a lot of bands, a lot of great uh, entertainment from out of town, um, you know, animals, all sorts of things in the parade. Yeah. And it's all part of the Irish Fest, too, it at is. the end of the week. Yes. Yeah. So what's that like, I guess, being a part of? Um, the I Well, the parade starts at 1. Mm -hmm. Irish Fest tent actually opens up at 11 a.m., and that goes from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m., and then we have the parade in, in within that. Yeah. So it's, you know, whatever you want to see on Saturday, we've, we've got it all here. I think it's fun, and you can go, again, to all the bars and restaurants around here and, and really celebrate. And what's the best way, what's the best way to, to celebrate, you know, St. Patrick's Day here? with your friends and family. Friends and family, that's what it's all about. And a little good music too. So we have live music over here. These are the New Dubliners. Guys, I'm gonna send it over to you and uh, they're gonna play away for us. And as they do so, we're gonna do some dancing. Come on, what's a little you know, Irish festival without some dancing? So guys, take it away.